Hi, I'm Charlotte Voisey here at the Manhattan Cocktail Classic. And taking a few minutes out of what is a very busy seminar schedule, I'm here with Jim Ryan from Hendrix Gin. Hey, Jim. Hey there. How are you, Charlotte? Good. Hi. So I hear you've just done a Hendrix Cocktail Academy for a... Yes, this is our delightfully peculiar cocktail academy, the Manhattan Cocktail Classic Edition. So this is a... Just a little gift from Hendrix Gin, uh, showing people a great way to make delicious, recreatable cocktails at home, learn a little bit about Hendrix Gin, and hopefully have a really great time. Great, so it wasn't just a usual kind of seminar. You had guys sitting down classroom style, but you actually showed them and then allowed them to practice how to make the drink. Is Absolutely, right? I think it's super critical for uh, to get a message across that it that drinks are not something to be afraid of. The bartending or cocktailing isn't something to be terrified of if you if you may not have experience at it. So everyone made their own drinks today. So if the drink wasn't great, it was their own fault. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> well, good. And I see you have all the tools laid out here. So are we set up to make a drink? Do yeah, to we're, true, yeah we're going to yeah. do a drink that I love called a cucumber lemonade. As I said, really simple, fresh ingredients. Uh, and Hendrix Gin, all those are the key elements that we'll be working with. So we'll start with uh, one and a half ounces of Hendrix Gin going into our jigger here. And do you mind if I follow along? No, so please, I encourage you to. Yeah, a trick or yeah, two. exactly. All right, so an ounce and a half of Hendrix. <laughs> yeah. And what comes next? We're gonna do uh, one full ounce of fresh squeezed lemon juice. Right. Yeah, and that's the uh, large end of the jigger there. Uh -huh. Yeah. You learn something new every day. I guess so. <laughs> Great. So uh, the room must have smelled good. How many uh, people did you have amazing. today? Well, um, given given the weather, I was a little worried that we may have like you know three or four, but we actually had it sold out. It was great. It was a wonderful turnout. Everyone was super engaged, and they had a great time. One ounce of simple syrup. There you are. There's three cocktails that everyone makes along the way. Okay. This is the second in their journey. Great. And the final cocktail that they make is a punch that they all create together. So they work together as a team. And one of the things that I love taking away at the end of a cocktail academy is complete strangers end up having new friends that they share this experience with. So it's a, it's a really rewarding uh, aspect for me. So I'm just going to add some ice in there. Okay. And then I'll top this with a little sparkling water. Great. Nice and refreshing. Is this the first time you've done a Cocktail Academy? Is it just in New York? <laughs> no, no, I'm actually, uh, no, this is not the first time I've done a Cocktail Academy. I've, I think I'm doing something like 143 of them this year. Goodness, really? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Are there two of you? Are you like cloning yourself? <laughs> yeah, I, uh, I sometimes I wish. Uh, and our garnish, a cucumber spear. Okay, just give a little stir like that. A little whirl of a stir -roll. It's like a pretty simple drink to put together. Absolutely. All right. Fresh, delightful, something you could drink on a warm summer's day. Cheers. Cheers.